Alright guys, so today I'm going to, to show you how you can get these boy, blowy background bars over here. Okay, so I'm going to show you how to do that in this video. In my other videos, there was these black bars from the other side of the screen. And now, uh, if you are like me, and you want to keep viewers viewing your video, uh, you can uh, replace those black bars with uh, more interesting looking bars. So, in this video, I will show you how to replace those bars with blurry bars. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is you want to go to App Store. And once you're here, you want to press on the search option. And you want to type in InShot. It is I-N-S-O-S-H-O-T. Once that pops up, uh, if you're on an iPad, then you want to click on the upper left-hand corner of the screen and press iPhone only. But, of course, if you're on an iPhone, then the app will automatically appeal if you're on an iPhone. But if you're on an iPad like me, press in the upper left hand corner. But anyways, click on the app Video Editor Music No Cut Co-op Cup and then download the app. Once it's downloaded, you can see it on your home screen and what you want to do is open the app. And from here it will look kinda weird if you're on an iPad because it's supposed to be for an iPhone. But once you it will tell you if you want to uh, allow them to do your photos. Just say yes. Basically say yes to everything. And once you say yes, uh, click on video right here. And what you want to do is you want to click on the video that you want to make have a blurry background to it. So, in this case, it's this one. And after that, it's going to process the video um, just to see it. And just wait a moment, it might take a little time, really depending on the internet. But once you're there, uh, you will basically, it will basically look like this. And what you want to do is you want to go to Canvas, right here. And then after you do that, you want to go to 16 by 9. That is the regular uh, ratio for videos. So you just want to click on that. And then you will see that there are blurry backgrounds at the ends of the video. So let me just click this button just to show you. And as you can see, it is uh, making it so that there is blurriness and it's following the image of the iPad. But one flaw with this app is that you have a little um, made with InShot over here. You can delete that by just pressing on the X over here. And once you do, it will probably say this. It will say, remove permanently, which is $2. Or you can remove this one, which is free. I recommend the free, but if you want to just keep the app forever and uh, you don't want to bother pressing the X, you can remove permanently. But for me, I would just do this. And then the watermark will be removed. And basically, that's it. Um, it basically adds a watermark in these videos and that's really it to the process. It's very easy. Um, now this app is an editor so if you want to change a filter or anything you can do that. Uh, if you want to add a sticker which is really cool for this app you can add that if you want to. Uh, all means just do whatever you want but yeah. So that's basically it for this video. And now I want to show you a comparison between the video before I did this and this video right now. So here is a video that I took that it just has a regular back ball background 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 that is really 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 boring. I don't like it and it's just it's just boring. So that's just a comparison but yeah, that's it guys. So if you like this video, leave a like. And if you haven't done so, subscribe. Bye.